everybody. Today we're gonna do punctuation. So remember to like, share, and subscribe. Let's get started. Period. A period is used at the end of a statement. Example: Today I learned how to use a period period in a sentence. Stop it. That means like when you're done with the sentence or like the paragraph, you must put a full stop. Exclamation points. An exclamation point is used to show exciting or emphasis at the end of a sentence. Example: I can't believe how great a day, a, how great of a day it is today. Then there's an exclamation mark. Wow! Question mark. A question mark is used at the end of a question. Can you help me carry in this box? What? Yeah. So like, ooh. A question. Oh. Comma. A comma is used to separate phrases or items in a list. Example: I need to buy an apple, an orange, and a banana. Give me a break. You use commas every time you're making a list. Semicolon. A semicolon is used to join two independent clauses. That are closely related. Example: Melissa went to the library to study. It was the only place quiet enough for her to focus. Hmm? I don't understand. El ellipsis. An ellipsis is used to indicate a pause or trailing off a thought. Example: Weeks later, I finally found my missing shoe. Let's pause. Of course. <coughs> Quotation marks. Let's begin. Stop talking. A quotation mark are used to mark the beginning and end of a quote or to show speech used in a sentence. Example: I'm excited to go to the zoo this weekend. Explained. Exclaimed Molly. Oh, I understand. Apostrophe. An apostrophe is used to show possession. Example: Jonah's new book of markers had fifty different colors. Fifty? How is there fifty? How? Colon. A colon is used to introduce groups of words in a series or introduce a quote. Example: Frank was going to buy three things: a lamp, a couch, and a book. They even use more punctuation. Wow! Let's introduce. Thank you for listening, everybody. So bye. And remember to like, share, and subscribe.